Pigeons are known to be highly intelligent birds. They were the first birds to be domesticated 2500 years ago. Pigeons were raised for meat and later for their innate ability to remember long distances and carry messages. All feral pigeons which we see in our cities are descendants of domesticated birds which escaped. From having been one of the most useful birds, pigeons have now gained notoriety for their sheer numbers. Pigeon droppings can be a menace around nesting areas and can corrode metal structures and stone buildings. The droppings can cause over 60 serious diseases in people and are toxic to our pets. High-rise apartments and buildings in the city mimic tall cliffs used by their ancestors. Much of the demand for pigeon control services came from industries on Bengaluru's outskirts until 10 years ago. Now, a major chunk of pigeon control inquiries come from residential complexes. The pigeon numbers have a lot to do with architecture. If you go back in time, they were uh, normally a house with a lot of greenery around, a small garden around. Now the whole scenario has changed. Naturally, uh, we need to prevent or indicate, I mean, convert all our flat ledges into sloping ledges. Feral pigeons are often blamed for other bird species disappearing from the urban terrain. But the fact that there aren't many fruit-bearing trees left in Bengaluru could be behind the disappearing birds. Sunil has more than 130 pigeons of several varieties. Pigeon racing enthusiasts like Sunil believe that the birds are being needlessly blamed. Low one percent is the answer, sir. Mm. But uh, no, it's too tender. The mosquitoes in there, it's tender. The pollution in there, it's tender. The garbage is there. All under all, I can't tell. Adun the yeast disease, sir. Ad mane atra na irata. Papa, you move prani gold mela actor. By not feeding feral pigeons in public places, the chance of any undue pressure on other species can be avoided. And branding a fellow being as vermin could divert attention from more important and real concerns.